How you doing guys? This is Hybrid Steel, welcome to Brewpub Simulator, and today is competition day. Oh, and we are not very excited. I'm going to be honest, I'm actually a little bit scared of this one. The reason why is because we're going to be taking on the hardest eight IPA, the hardest drink, on this list of things that we can create to compete in the competition of we are the champions. That's all we got to do. So, for those who like the less bitter IPA, is also called the New England IPA. I don't know why you guys might know because I'm not from New England I'm from the original England we need water light malt extract which I have quite quantities of water we have some light malt citra simcoe and magnum hops citra hold on uh, da, 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 da. citra aha we have citra I need magnum as well that's the silvery packet this one and what was the other one I need uh, maybe I should pin this recipe just to be sure right not that one, that's the uh, that's the APA again. I've done this so many times now. Right, the hazy. All right, Matt, Citra, Simcoe. Simcoe, Simcoe, Simcoe is the yellow one, that one. Hey, we got all three, fantastic. Okay, so first I'm gonna do a, actually, what's the liter do I need of this? Do I need like five liters? For, I do need five liters, so we can we can turn, there we go, okay. So that's the, that should be the one that we need. So I don't need my big cooking pot, I need my little cooking pot. Hello, little cooking pot. Okay, 5.3 litres of El Watero. There we go, 331. 331. Uh, 5.31. Okay, so in order to read through this first off, we need 1.4 litres of light malt. Where did I put it all? Oh, yes, yeah, over there. Uh, donut. Okay, so we need 1.4 litres. That's okay. Two grams of magnum hops. Right. After 20 minutes, three grams of magnum hops. After boiling for another 20 minutes, add 3 grams of citra. After 20 minutes, turn off the stove. Then add 10 grams of Simcoe, 10 grams of citra, and 5 ml of yeast. Oh my god. Right, okay, cool. Let's chuck all this in. 1.4 litres of this stuff, so pretty much all of it. Okay, so there's 1.4 in there. Fantastic. Add 2 grams of Magnum Hop. Just 2. Alright, cool. Uh, turn on the stove, start boiling, and then we've got to add three grams of that and three. So I need to do three grams of magnum, and then after, yeah, so we need to start, boil for 20 minutes, three grams of magnum, then another 20 minutes, then three grams of citra. And we'll leave that to one side, because these are the first two we need before cooling down. Start boiling, I'm going to get ready with my magnum hop here at three grams, which I can't believe I have to do three grams. This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Here we go. Let's just wait for 20 seconds, shall we? Okay, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 1, 2, 3. Magnum, done. Right. Put it down! Citra! Oh, <laughs> my heart is like pounding right now because it's like I need to get this like dead on like 20 seconds each time or 20 minutes. Here we go again. Three grams of citra hops going in. Two, three. Excellent, okay. Then the next we need to wait for 20 minutes and then boil. So when it gets to 60, then we turn it off. Oh, this is like heart pounding. I don't like this one. This is like a lot of effort. Just too much effort. Ready and off. Okay, so I need to get my Simcoe. So this is going to be 20 grams. Uh, no, 10 grams? I almost put double the portion. In. So 10 grams of Simcoe. And then 10 grams of Citra. And then 5 mil of ale beer. I feel like an actual real brewer doing this. Is this going to be like you have to boil it, you have to do this for like 12 days? I mean, this is a big but. And the thing is, because it's three flavours, this should instantly be like Gold Star. Should. And we've got three days. Oh, bums. Right. Well, I've got to skip days. Oh, <sighs> okay. Right. Um, I suppose I better start serving because I need three grand as well. If we can hit our prime, if we can hit our number, yeah, we should be all right. Okay, let's get this party started, shall we? I'm hoping we make like three hundred dollars, four hundred, maybe five hundred would be amazing. But we'll see how things go. If we come, yep, just start work and we'll be all right. So I'm hoping, really hoping that things happen fast, quickly, and all good. Need money, need money, 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 money. And here's where it's going to get a little bit busy. How you doing, lady? Welcome to the bar. Bye. Well, good. Bye. No? You don't want a beer. You just want to walk through. I hate you. Right, cool. Ne no, sir? Beer? No? Cool. Anybody want a beer? Anybody? Beer? No? 
Anybody know bit? This is like waiting for people to go for slim fast bars and realizing that chocolate's on the other side. Rad Brad! Right. Let me get a Rad Brad. Nikolai, Rad Brad. There we go. Oh, yeah. There we are. Ah, oh, Brad Brad for you, lady. Lady in the red dress who's past her prime. Come on, everybody who wants a drink. I know I'm going to have to switch over kegs at some point. Hey, we might be able to get a lager out at the same time. Are we nearly out of beer? Right. Yes, sir. What can I get you? Anybody want an actual beer? No? Are you serving this man, by the way? Right, I suppose I better start cleaning up then. Well, there we go then. Well, I tried helping, but apparently uh, no one wanted my help, so it's fine. I'll just carry on being a bus boy. I'm good. I, I don't mind. It keeps me out of the way of the public. I don't get angry at people. I don't punch people in the face. I think I'll survive. It's all good. Anyways, just hope that the world is a better place without me. <laughs> Are we nearly out? Nearly. I think we're nearly uh, nearly out. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you do have some horrible customers around here, don't you? I just want to throw my litter on the floor because I'm horrible. I don't know where a bin is, so I'm just going to throw it all over the floor and screw you over a bit more. Anyways, thanks for the glass. Hello. Lummy. Right, there we go. we got one beer left. I suppose I better go and get the other keg ready then. Alright, cool. So, we'll take this off, put this over here. Which one's ready? That one's ready. Cool. One pipe. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it. No. Nope. All good. John T7, you're up for sale, mate. John T7 to the rescue. Yeah. That's how we do it. Oh, right, okay. He's up for sale. I just need, I need to go. And have it. John T7 is now up for sale. That's good. Right. I suppose we're going to clean some more stuff up before people start getting arsey with it. I mean, if they stopped dropping rubbish all over the floor, I wouldn't have this problem. But no, I'm, it's like dealing with a trough full of horses. Nay, <clears throat> despicable behaviour. How can you tell, right, that even though I'm a little bit of a slob, I genuinely don't like a lot of mess. The things that drive me mad the most, just people leaving their gl glasses around. When I go to a bar, right, I don't leave my glass on the table. I take my glass back to the bar because it's good manners. You know, get, give the bartender, you know, a little bit of a rest. They've been serving you for five hours. They've been on their feet the whole time whilst you've been sitting around and gallivanting around with your friends. And then all of a sudden, they're dealing with you. Seriously, just g give them a little bit of a break, you know? No, don't like doing that, do we? No, John. No, we don't like doing that. There you go. Have some glasses back. Cool. Right. You done with this glass, sir? Thank you. Seems to be a lot of people. Yes, sir. What can I get you? A bin of a, 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 a yeah, that one. Well, that's a Nikolai. That might be the wrong one. Yes, madam. Number two. Oh yeah, no, the other, number two is the other one, wasn't it? That's my bad. My bad. APA. There you go. Have a great evening. Yes, sir. What can I get you? APA. We're just about to run out of Nikolai. Oh no. Oh no. Nikolai was like the last beer that I had that was going to last me that long, and that was like 39 liters of Nikolai. Damn. We've got some heavy drinkers. We're all out of Nikolai. We've only got an hour left. I think we're just going to have to run with it, aren't we? We've got 10 litres left of John T7, so we should be okay. <laughs> I love the fact that all my beers are named after you guys. So thank you very much for all the uh, the names. It's been fantastic. Wow, that's skill, that is. It's going to balance it up. Boom. All cleaned up. 74%. Not too bad. Can I take this glass? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, and thank you. Ah, oh, full rack. <laughs> right, stick all that in there. Clean up after her, because she's a messy little pup. There we go. Get out of my way. Clean, get that clean. Oh, they're dropping food wrappers down there. One will never know. Eight customers, is it eight or six? No, six customers are left in here, and they're still making, they're still pouring money. We're at $2,991. Come on! I need to sell, like, one more thing. 298, come on. We need like one more sale. And then we made our three grand. It's probably not gonna happen tonight. $63 in tips. Few more customers left. Winding down the rest of the night now. And it's been a good night, it really has. The downside is it could have been a little bit better if uh <laughs> if we'd have made like an extra four bucks. <laughs> oh damn. <laughs> Excuse me, mate. Arms for the poor. <laughs> do you want a pint? Do you want a drinky? Buy a drink. Buy some John. Get. We got a table though. We're okay. Oh, and a, and a round table. Who is it? 298 is not. 2998. That's good. Real good. We're almost out of beer. 
I mean, we're all out of our fermentation buckets, so everything we do have is now just lager. I mean, that will make us the money that we need, you know, so I, mean, I can transfer that over now. Um, I think I had one more request for a beer name, so I th give me a second. Let me just pull this out. Need a keg, need a pipe. Oh yeah, this is Queen. So Queen's up for sale. So this is our strawberry uh, lager, which I thought was a good mix. You know, we've never done one before, so that was all right. And then I've got one more lager in my pot, and I think this is Papa Roach because someone said that they wanted the lyrics on, and I couldn't remember that I couldn't remember who said it, so I just called the beer Papa Roach. Stick that up on there. It's the last one. One connection tube goes in there. Nice. Fantastic. Right. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to quickly sell the rest of my hoard, and we've got two days left of waiting for that one to be brewed. So I'm just going to go off and play this, get all this done, and we'll go from there. But yeah. It's going well. And there we go. Day 59. And we're done. Well, we got $3,400. Holy crud. We are rich. Rich people. Apart from I've got to spend three grand paying off the loan. <laughs> oh, no. Right. We ran out of a, f a few, which was good. It means business is booming. 3.9 reputation. That's sort of about average. I'm never going to see five again. As long as I'm, I've got like four tables full of people and all the people turn up left, right and centre, I'm never going to be able to hit the numbers I need. So we've still got eight litres of Papa Roach left, which is okay. And we've got 743 litres of Queen. <laughs> Queen sold really well. I want to break free. And getting away with murder over here. Yeah, eight litres. Right. So I've got one more day to skip through and then we've got to ship that off into a beer and then we're done. And then we're, and then we're fine. Oh no, I did that thing again. Let me just shut shop. So unfortunately, I forgot to turn off my stuff. So I just spent $60 on not a lot. So this is the Hazy IPA. Look at this. Five star. I'm pretty sure that's a, I'm pretty sure that's a gold beer as well. So we're, we're good on that. And because this is the a one-off, and in all honesty, um, I'm going to have to add this person in as well. This was a special request. I'm going to put in some weasels. There you go, some weasels. You're a special beer. $8.84 for you. That's a good beer. Right. On that note, what I'm going to do quickly here is I'm going to turn my staff off because now we're going to be doing quite a few little bits and pieces. Uh, so first off, I want to make this beer up. So I need to put this in a keg and then ship it off. So this can go down here. Some weasel is there. Some weasel goes into the keg. Fantastic. And then we, I'm going to send this off to the competition. Obviously get to the locker first, then we accept the mission, then we're done. Right, that can go there. Email, local brewing tournament, accept. Slam that in there. Some weasels, I hope you bring me the luck I need. Alright, cool. So now I'm going to stand outside and look at this iconically and go, yeah. Alright, so now we need to click here and... I now own the bar. It is mine. I have received information that you have repaid your grandfather's debt and have become the official owner of the brew pub. Get in. On this occasion, I would like to warmly congratulate you. Thank you very much, Harvey. I did it. The brew pub is officially mine. I have proven that I am worthy of my heritage. Debt paid. Congratulations. Ah, here we go. So the bar is officially mine. I'm doing good. I've only got $348 left, but I don't have a debt anymore. I don't have that lingering horribleness over the top of my head anymore going, you need to pay. So now we've got we've got final tests and we've got things to do. So I've got to do a football watch party first. I'm a regular visitor at your bar and love your beer. There will be a football match soon and we plan to throw a watch party at my place. I don't want people to get too drunk though. We need something with a low alcohol percentage. Think you can provide us with a beer? You know what? I probably can, Tony, but I think that's going to be best for another day. And then we got our final test. Hey, you. I have the ultimate test for you. Prepare for a, me a beer worthy of a master. I want the most fancy lager that I can make. All right, cool. So these are, this, this is going to be my last video. This one. Well, my next video. So my next video is going to be the football watch party and the final test. Right now, I'm hoping we're going to be doing this like... We're going to be doing this thing. We're going to be getting this competition done. So I need to skip another day. 
Three grand for a daily outtake. Yep, it hurt a little bit. <sighs> Congratulations, I have won the tournament. Beer contest award level one, I got $100. Oh, and now I feel like an accomplished beer maker. Oh, yes, oh, 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 suit you, sir. All right, cool, so what was my decoration I just earned? All right, so let's just hang up some more lights and make this look a bit more sort of nicer in here. I've got some funky wall art, which I have no idea why I've got it. It's just one of those things. I'm gonna put this above the door. I think that looks all right up there. That looks all right. Now, cash. That looks that looks like it's in the right place. Uh, stop and drink. Hmm, where am I going to put this? I want to put... Uh, I've got to be honest. I would love to put this like on the front of the building, but I can't. That looks all right. And my casino hut one. Casino has to go above the arcade machines, doesn't it? <laughs> it just has to go there. This is looking nice now, man. I like it. It actually feels like a proper bar. I like this feel. I don't know if you do as well. If you do, let me know in the comment section below. I'd love to hear your thoughts about what I do on there. Hopefully, everything's all clean and dandy now. and We're all good. So, we've got tournament level 2 to do. And then we've got oh, we've got 74 reviews to pile through. So most 4s and 5s, which is quite nice. We're seeing a couple of 3s. That's alright. So, the next thing we've got to do is we've got to do a... We invite you to take part in our brewing contest. The rules are simple. Brew your own beer and send the keg to us. The jury will rate your beer based on their creativity. The best one wins. So the minimum fanciness is silver. So this has to be a silver bit. This has to be a silver. So the thing that I like brewing the most is APAs. APAs, I know the recipe off by heart. And I know what recipes work that we could get a gold in as well. So that's genuinely a decent one. Uh, the albatross one minimum has to be gold so we have to brew a gold lager so that means it has to be a lager with at least three flavors in it and that has to come out in bloody good condition so in my next video then we're going to be running through both of these in one go I want to, uh, basically i've got an idea of how to do it so i don't really need to open the bar as well we've got all our ingredients we should be completely fine uh thank you very much to the person who recommended queen i'm going to basically sell off the keg now and we're done so I don't need it anymore. And this one will run out before the end of it. So I'm going to get rid of Papa Roach as well. So if I need anything, we're good. But I think that in my next video, we're going to be brewing up for two competitions now. And I basically want to annihilate it all and basically become the best brewer in the world. So until my next video live stream or whatever else to do on this channel, guys, thank you very much for kicking by. Thank you very much for supporting. And thank you very much for just hitting that subscribe button. It means the most. Until my next one, peace out. Have fun. Enjoy everything you guys do. Bye-bye for now.